Hello everyone, Killy Cow Divine here playing Pro Cycling Manager 2016. Yeah, uh, I am back after a short hiatus of a few weeks. Uh, I was on vacation for a bit, then I unist uh, reinstalled Windows. Uh, took me some time to set up uh, so that I could record again. So, Coppa Agostini Lizone Lizone. It's the race we are going to do today, 193.9 kilometers. You can see our race day conditioning is minus one because we are tired. Tiredness is the main impact. It is red. I think we're gonna simulate this this race. See what happens. Our guy did decently well. We came in 14th place. 48 seconds behind the winner. GP Industria and Commercio di Prato. Um, quite a decent race it seems, but I'm gonna simulate this one as well. I'm also gonna simulate uh, Del no, uh, another Italian race, Di Monte something. And then I will ride uh, Lombardia. That's a big uh, one day race. So we, can, we will see how we do there. So, Gipe Industria and Commercio di Prato, 12th place. Nothing really strange going on. So, Giro del Piemonte, 25th place. We were not nearly strong enough, but now it is getting close to Lombardia. But before we come to Lombardia, we get the next level, another level up. Um, not the level up we were hoping for. Recovery, that's good. Stamina, that's good. Sprint, we needed that. We wanted acceleration, didn't get that. Uh, hills plus one, mountain plus one. Not a very strong uh, level up, but at least we are level 18 now. So we are about to start uh, in Lombardia. It's between Como and Bergamo. Uh, quite a tough uh, race, one of the biggest uh, one day races in the calendar, uh, 247 kilometers, so it's very long. Uh, we still get minus one uh, for tiredness. Tried my best to get the tiredness down, but yeah, it was just uh, not going to happen, I guess. Our fitness is not very strong either, but at least we need to try and do something here. So we are racing. Um, this, this is the first time I'm playing uh, since I updated, updated uh, and reinstalled uh, Windows 10. I had some problems with it, so I reinstalled it. Uh, so the, I'm getting some pop-ups and such with information. Um, I'm playing. Hopefully it will not uh, be much more of that, but it can come at any time, I guess. I got one for the breakaway. You can see I am on my own today, no one is wanting to help me on my team. I have a plus one day, uh, nothing really changed with that. You can see my teammate Jan Hirt is trying to get away, but it's way too early for that. He will not have the energy to make it all the way, I can promise you that. So it will just be a long ride until these climbs start, then I guess something will happen, and we will see if we are strong enough to hold on. We're not among the top 10 favorites, so it could be difficult for us today. So we are about to enter the first major climb here towards the end. There it is, uh, the breakaway is still in the lead, it was 15 minutes, now it's down to less than 4 minutes. It's going to melt away fast. You can see Andreev uh, is doing all the work now. Kangek, uh, the Estonian, have been doing a lot of the work. Erik Chavez have been there helping. Uh, Kwiatowski, one of our arch rivals, have uh, is the favorite to win today. So, uh, we need to keep up with Darius. Only a few riders are capable of National Bing is riding for, up. and National Bing has a strong team here. But there are other strong riders as well. 
if I'm gonna do something, I guess I'm gonna wait for the final climb. The small climb towards them. <sighs> am I alone in the pack now? Yes, I am. 67 riders in total. I need to get water, so I'm gonna drop down and get water during this climb. Gonna go a bit faster. Come on. Yes, he got the water and he's moving up now. That's what I wanted. That he could move up during the the downhill. So now I am ready for the final 36 kilometers. Some people are trying to move up, but Kelleman has very high pace. And we can see Ulisse is the first one to go. He is getting a small break. Uh, we can see it is Costa chasing. Costa without a bike. Oh, all of them are without bikes. <laughs> okay. I think there must have been some some problem this with uh, when I installed this game again. <laughs> this is a bit... I didn't notice this before, but no one is on a bike. It's just the pedals and the water bottle. Okay, that's a bit strange. Uh, I guess after this... Uh, race, I would need to check the if I can get them back somehow. Maybe I need to install the same uh, uh, real name database I used before. Would that make a difference? No, not with the bikes, I think. Okay, I need to start making sure I have a good position soon. I am at 90 effort. Oh, I can't really remember how to do the last 10 kilometers. I wasn't very good at them to begin with. Maybe it will be even worse now. Okay, the pace is starting to rise here. We can see Kelderman moving ahead. I need to take my energy bar and maybe I can get a gap. It is. Yep, yeah, I'm getting a small gap here. It's a bit too early, I think, but better to try and fail than to never have tried at all. I have 16 seconds, it's, it's growing slowly. Twent no, it's going down again. It's staying, oh, 21 seconds, that's good. Only five, kilometers left. five kilometers left, I seem to have a good energy here. I'm gonna go up to 99 effort. Oh, I have a... I'm gonna, I'm gonna win this. Four kilometers left to go. I have 40 seconds. It is going up. I am going all out, but it's a bit downhill near, here, I think. So it should be fine. Three kilometers left to go. We are in the final downhill. The sprint can be started. I'm gonna start the sprint. The sprint I am the going to win this. It's going up. to be a big victory. Might even be one and a half minute or more. There we go. A huge win. Congratulations. He showed determination to add this that was to uh, that was really good actually. I'm really happy about that. Building Lombardia. You can see it's going to be two minutes. Exactly two minutes ahead of Kwiatowski and Michael Matthews. That was absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. It is confirmed. Il, Il Lombardia. Two minutes ahead of uh, uh, the pack, led by Michael Kwiatowski. That's a big win, and it was a perfect attack towards the end. And we can actually see that we get a first victory in a monument. This monument is uh, one of the big uh, one-day races. I guess this is why this one is blue. So we get 100 points for that. And to end the season, we are going to J uh, Japan Cup. It's between Utsunomi Utsunomiya. Well, it's all about Utsunomiya. Utsunomiya. Uh, I guess it's it looks like uh, there are laps around the course. Um, we are in Japan Cup. Uh, we are one of the three biggest favorites, we are, or we are the the third biggest favorite. Uh, 13 kilometers left, or just about. Uh, I need to up my effort, 
so I am ready to move here you can see I'm having a minus two day and my fitness is poor so I'm having a really bad day I still think I can do something I think BMC is riding for Villarmos you can see Betancourt is there as well and uh, BMC is doing most of the work here are we in the final climb here nope it's about to start I need to go 10 kilometers left I'm gonna go I'm gonna go let's watch me pull away okay <laughs> this is not going well uh, BMC and movie star is riding way too fast for me okay that was too early can I regain my position and maybe get some power left uh, back uh, some strength back uh, eight kilometers left so still a lot that can happen I'm not in a position to attack yet I need to get more red bar back uh, this is going to be a sprint finish and I'm not very good in a in a sprint Five so with four kilometers left I'm gonna see if I can attack let's go ride fast and there we go attack can I get away I do not think I can Again, an attack is I'm getting a small gap apart. very very small gap and we are 10 seconds ahead but the sprint is about to start do not think we can keep them behind us in a sprint like this there we go there sprint we go. guy sprint guy off. and the sprinters are moving past me easily I'm gonna get top 5 maybe top 10 at least oh they oh are I can see right way too fast for me but to get back in the top 10 oh 9th place really and just the confirmation screen uh, 9th place so now uh, next season we are going to ride for Borra Argon 18 again we have been faithful to the team for quite a while now um, I guess we will try and go to Tour de France we tried Giro and uh, the Vuelta this season it went well in both we were at the top uh, we got the uh, under 25 jersey from uh, Vuelta España so maybe we need to try Tour de France this time I think we will be able to to do something there even if top five would be a good goal to have uh, but that will be next season there will be a lot of other a lot of other races taking place i'm sure uh, until then i'm killing cow divine and thank you all for watching